Appendix Moreover, Manjushri, when the master of medicine Barrow Radiance Tathagata attained Bodhi, because of the power of his former vows, he was able to observe sentient beings. He saw that some were suffering from various diseases and were emaciated because of love sickness, desiccated, suffering from malaria, and so on. Others had been poisoned by black magic. Further, others were naturally short-lived or were to have untimely deaths. He then wanted to remove the suffering due to diseases and cause the being's desires to be fulfilled. At that moment, the Bhagavat entered the Samadhi called Queller of the Sufferings of All Beings. Having entered the Samadhi, a great brilliant light shone from the excrescence on his head, and from its midst a great Dharani was taught. I honor the Bhagavad Master of Medicine, King of Barrow Radiance, Tathagata, Arhat, perfectly enlightened one, saying, To the healer, to the healer, to the supreme healer, hail! Namo Bhagavate Bhaisyajya Guru Vaidurya Prabharajaya Tathagataya Arhate Samyaksam Buddhaya Tadiyatha Om Bhaisyajya 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 Swaha Then this Dharani, having been taught in the light, the great earth shook and emitted a great light. The suffering caused by the diseases of all sentient beings was removed. They all became peaceful and joyous. O Manjushri, if there is a son or daughter suffering because of disease, for the sake of that person one should always earnestly clean and bathe him or her. One should provide them with food, medicine, or clean water free of insects, and recite the Durrani over these things one hundred and eight times. Then make that person take the medicine, food, or water. Then all their suffering from disease will disappear. If one desires something, just recite the Dharani and one will obtain it. One will be without illness. His or her life will be prolonged, and at the end of their life he or she will be born in that realm of pure barrel. One will attain the state of non-retrogression on the path to the enlightenment until final Bodhi. That is why, Manjushri, if there is a son or daughter who, with utmost sincerity, most respectfully, worships that master of medicine, Barrow Radiance Tathagata, that person should always hold on to that Dharani and never forget it. Moreover, Manjushri, if there is a son or daughter with pure faith who is able to hear the name of Master of Medicine, Barrow Radiance Tathagata, worthy of offerings, our hot, perfectly enlightened one, and, having heard it, holds on to it and recites it, such a person should, at dawn, chew the tooth stick, bathe, and purify himself. He should worship the image of that Buddha with all kinds of fragrant flowers, burn incense, offer perfumed unguents, and play music of all sorts. He should copy this sutra by himself, or cause others to do so. And he should wholeheartedly hold on to it and try to understand its meaning. He should worship and reward the Dharma master who teaches the sutra, offering him all the necessities of life, making sure that he lacks nothing, Having done this, that person will be covered by the protective thoughts of the Buddhas, and all that he seeks for shall be fulfilled until he attains Bodhi. Namo Bhagavate Bhaisyajya Guru Vaidurya Prabharajaya Tathagataya Arhate Samyaksam Buddhaya Tadiyatha Om Bhaisyajya 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 Swaha Namo Bhagavate Bhaisyajya Guru Vaidurya Prabharajaya Tathagataya Arhate Samyaksam Buddhaya Tadiyatha Om Bhaisyajya 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 Swaha